-hmm. impacted by any cold weather right. or even rainy weather. And it will be kind of chilly this weekend. It will be, yes. yes. We've got a little bit of a temperature drop for okay. Saturday. We get back to about normal on Sunday, though. Here's a look at temperatures outside right now. 36 degrees in Galax, 47 in Winston-Salem and in Greensboro. But temperatures don't really budge all that much as we head through the day today. So I wouldn't expect a huge warm up. In fact, we'll just end up kind of close to normal. As we are looking outside at satellite and radar, we've got a couple of rain showers to our east and in the mountains we've got a couple of snow showers we've also got some stronger winds in the mountains winds throughout our area for the most part in the 10 to 15 mile per hour range but once you head to the high country we've got winds in excess of 20 miles per hour plus gusts on top of that and some of our mountain gusts could be in the 45 mile per hour range today so that's part of why we've got this winter weather advisory for the high country this is for some of our counties and it's because we've got some snow showers only one to four inches expected, so not incredibly high snow totals, especially for the mountains. We could have some more snow above 3,500 feet, but the issue, of course, is that we've got those slippery roads that will affect the morning and the afternoon commute, and we also have those winds gusting to 45 miles per hour, meaning low visibility at times on the roads because that snow continues to blow back into your windshield. Here's a look, an impact day all day in the mountains because of that flurry chance and because of the wind making things feel a little bit worse and making things harder on the roads. For the foothills, temperatures get into the upper 40s. We've got the winds in the 20 mile per hour range throughout a lot of the day and in the triad 20 to 25 mile per hour winds are possible, especially as we head through the middle part of the day. Here's a look at our hour by hour forecasts and you'll notice that most of us will be drying out and even getting some beautiful sun in the mix, but all throughout the day those scattered snow showers continue. It's not a consistent snow, but gradually it will add up through the day and cause some concerns for us. Overnight temperatures will fall down below freezing pretty early in the evening and then stay below freezing. So slick roads possible even as early as Saturday morning, which is likely part of the reason why they have that winter weather advisory not expiring until 7 a.m. tomorrow. Here's a look at our weekend all throughout our area. A cooler day for your Saturday. Temperatures in the mid to low 40s, even in the Piedmont and the foothills. Warmer for Sunday. Here's your seven day forecast. Over the next few days after that, we'll continue warming 60s by midweek next week, but also some rain headed our way at that point. Good morning. Coming up on today, we'll have a lot more overnight on the sudden death of Lisa Marie Presley just hours after she was rushed to